Hi, William from WMD here with some audio demos of the phase displacement oscillator used as an LFO. First, we have maths set up as a clock running into the 4MS RCD and into the sync of the phase displacement oscillator. PDO is controlling the VCA, so increasing the speed increases the um, speed at which the waveform is being cut. If we pull the sync, it becomes completely unsynced. Now adjusting the phase, PDO is controlling the gamma wave source's parameter control. This is adjusting the phase. In this patch, we have the same sequence with the addition of the gamma wave being run through the Hadron Collider. And channel 2 of the PDO is now controlling the frequency of the Hadron Collider. We're still dividing by 16. If we take channel 3 and plug it into the phase input of channel 4, we can get multiple movements in channel 4 using the phase input. We could also take our math signal, plug that into channel 2. Or just channel 3. This is a patch using two PDOs, the first one running in LFO mode, and it is self-modulating through this PDO using SuperSaw running through the Hadron Collider in elliptic filter mode. The noise is a result of the self-modulation of this, this modulating, this modulating itself. And it fades away because one LFO is controlling the VCA.
This is a patch using this PDO as an LFO, this PDO as an oscillator. Output 3, the oscillator is running into channel 4's phase input and using it as an LFO to going into the Hadron Collider. And what's, what it's doing is phase modulating the LFO signal and it's distorting it on the top and bottoms of the sine wave going in. Sawtooth wave running into it and you end up with a clipping type sound. So this is the sound of it. And it's being synced. And if we have the same LFO PDO, control the frequency. By changing the phase, you can change where the accents lie. This is a patch with the gamma wave source as our VCO. Um, this is putting out our upper octave, one octave below. Each output is the same and going into these two phase inputs. That sounds like this. You can use this to modulate and adjust the, the pitch. Additionally, we have the same setup, the sum output, going into our other PDO, tuned about two octaves below.
This is a patch with the synchrodyne in self-oscillation producing a sine wave tone running into the Pittsburgh audio analog delay being controlled by outputs three and four from the PDO and that is synced by our RCD. PDO is not making any changes because it's set all the way low. If we unsync it, 